Right. Hi, everyone. Welcome again to Author Story. I'm Alexander Lim, your host. And for this episode, I'm interviewing Yuki Oikawa, who is speaking on behalf of Master Ryuho Okawa, author of the book The Laws of Justice, How We Can Solve World Conflicts and Bring Peace. And for those of you who are following along who are interested, you can go over now to the Amazon link in the description below the video and check out, or even better, get a copy of the book. So, Yuki, uh, welcome to Author Story. It's our privilege to have you as our guest today. Yoroshiko onegaishimasu. Alex, thank you very much. And your, your Japanese is excellent. Ah, arigato, arigato. <laughs> <laughs> so, Yuki, to start off, uh, for the benefit of those among our listeners who aren't yet familiar with Happy Science and Master Okawa, can you give us a short overview of who he is and what Happy Science is all about? Okay, so Ryuho Okawa uh, he is, uh, this, this name is uh, very famous and popular in Japan okay. and Asia uh, because he is, uh, first of all, the, the best of Thera author. Mm -hmm. He published so many books and uh, the many books became a medium, over medium bestseller. Wow. Uh, he, he, is, he is writing about the, the you know, lifestyle and the religion, mm -hmm. spiritual issues and even political issues. Mm. And this time, uh, this beginning of this year, he published the Laws of Justice, mm. uh, dealing with the international politics mm. from the spiritual point of view, which is very unique. Okay. And he and he established Happy Science thirty yes. years ago in Japan. Wow. Okay. And ha Happy Science is a spiritual movement mm -hmm. based uh, based on the traditional Buddhism uh, Buddhism principles, mm -hmm. uh, but including the uh, the other spiritual religious principles. Mm -hmm. And he created the new movement, which became very famous and popular. And uh, uh, not only Japan expand the all over the world. He uh, he, he got uh, uh, so many I think uh, over ten million members. Wow! Uh, in over a hundred countries in the wow. world. Wow! Okay, countries such as, uh, of course, the United States. I I, I I'm sure. But what other, other countries? And, uh, the, Happy Science has uh, Happy Science USA. Okay. Uh, uh, the uh, they have a local church in, mm -hmm. in New York, Los Angeles, San Francisco. Mm -hmm. okay. And also, uh, Alex, I, I I've had you are now in in Philippines. Okay. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> okay. Cool. So we have we have we have a, we have a, a Happy Science Philippines. Oh, okay. In, in Manila. Oh, okay. Oh, that's so, fantastic. Okay. So, and, and also Happy Science is not just for spiritual movement. Mm. Uh, the we have a. Uh, uh, the uh, the school, uh, mm -hmm. you know, uh, middle middle school and even new university, Happy mm -hmm. Science University. Okay, and I suppose and, that's based in Japan. Based in Japan. Oh, okay, all right. And and then uh, the Ryuho Kawa uh, recently created the new political party, mm. political party, which is called the Happiness Realization Party. Mm. So I I belong to the. The Happiness Realization Party mm -hmm, as mm -hmm. a, a, a international affairs uh, director. Mm, okay, interesting. So this is like a political party in Japan. Then I mean, you guys are also involved with pol politics and all that. That's right. Okay, interesting, interesting. So mm -hmm. Yuki, about yourself, can you tell us a little about yourself? What's your background, and how did you get involved with Happy Science? Mm -hmm. uh, I used to work in the Merrill Lynch American. Financial Institute in New York Wall Street, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and then I, and then I moved to the the city of London mm -hmm. uh, in in England, and, okay. and I joined the UK financial company. I I used to be a, a financial consultant, ah. and right, and and I was I was dealing with the money market. Okay, <laughs> yeah. okay. So and then I I I found the whole cards books, mm -hmm, and then mm -hmm. I the. The, those days, I was a uh, uh, I was a Christian. Okay. I was a pro Protestant. Oh, okay. And then, and then I joined Happy Science. I learned his principles, mm. and then I changed my career uh, mm. from the the financial industry to the spiritual industry. Oh, okay. You know, I became an international minister of oh, okay. Happy Science. Oh, okay. I'm so, just okay. Go ahead, please. And then, and then, and, and then I joined the, the Happiness Realization Party. Mm. So now I'm an international political uh, commentator. Okay. Uh, the joining the the especially U.S. radio shows like your shows. Mm. Okay. Cool. So isn't this a big change? I mean, first you start in financial, and then you got into uh, into a mm. spiritual kind of career. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, uh, because I I, I, I I used to be Christian, mm. I strongly believe in God mm. from the Christian point of view. Mm. But I realized that there are many other uh, spiritual teachings, mm. religious teachings, mm. and and then I I became more open-minded. Mm. So uh, uh, because of the focus uh, new new principles mm-hmm, mm-hmm. so that was a big change mm-hmm. okay cool i got that mm-hmm, mm-hmm. so let's go a little bit into the book uh can you tell mm-hmm. us a little more about a bit a little bit more about it what's it all about okay uh you know the recently uh, people in the world the faced the many uh international political conflicts such mm. as you know terrorism and and also uh, the many conflicts in in uh, regional place in uh, on, in 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 the world. Yes. So and uh, our problem is uh, that we don't have international uh, global leader who mm. can solve this problem. Right. Right. So uh, Liu Hokawa, the author of this book, Laws of Justice, mm. strongly insists now we should come back to the starting point of what is justice. Mm-hmm. So uh, justice is not just the, the decided by uh, the number of votes. So right. justice should come from God's will. Mm-hmm. So uh, which is very difficult, you know. Even <laughs> even you deeply pray for God, yeah, it's very yeah. difficult to get you know understand <laughs> God's will. True, but, true. But now uh, we should do that mm-hmm. and think about God's will. So mm-hmm. otherwise. It's very difficult to solve the international conflicts. Ah, yeah, definitely. I mean, it's it's mm-hmm. a it's a mess right now. <laughs> mm-hmm. So, for whom is this book intended? Is this intended for you know just like uh, policymakers, leaders, or can like any person who just walks off the street, common man, oh, he right. can he just that, read that... it and you know pick something up from it? Right, right. So that's very the. It, 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 very important question. So sounds like this book, you know, this book, the the aiming for uh, just political leader, mm-hmm. but actually the author uh, would like to present this book to ordinary people. Mm. You know, so the people now, more people uh, now become educated, mm. and then and we share international information by uh, not only mass media but also the internet media mm-hmm. so uh, that's why the people should be awakened mm-hmm. to to the international politics mm. from the spiritual point of view i see so anyone can it's really intended for anyone uh anyone any person anyone. okay any good. person but regardless of religion races mm. you know nationalities, nationalities. okay Interesting, interesting. Yeah, so it looks, it sounds like a good read. Mm-hmm. Okay, so this book covers a topic that, I mean, let's face it, just the word justice. You say the word justice, and different people will apply different meanings to it. Like, say, to a person who's a victim of a crime, it might mean some sort of legal redress to gain satisfaction. To another person, like maybe living in a war zone or something like that, it might be uh, having enough food to last through the day. From what, from the perspective of the book, is the real definition of justice? Mm-hmm. So, uh, for, uh, let me give you uh, the uh, example. Okay. You know, uh, the, in this book, the author talked about uh, the issue of IS, Islam, Islamic State. Okay. Okay. Right. So this is the our common problem. Mm. So uh, the the Islamic State based on is it's based on the teaching of Islam, yes, the, which is a, the world religion, mm-hmm. but uh, the, maybe from the Christian world and from the Asian world, mm-hmm. it's very difficult to mm-hmm. understand the Islam. Mm. So or we, we, the reason is we don't have enough knowledge mm. on Islam. Okay. Uh, on the other hand, Islam, Islam, Islamic people, uh, they don't have enough knowledge on the our side, you know, okay. free world. Right, right. So this structure, this structure, caused the big conflict. Mm. So, so now uh, we should we should learn, we should know what is Islam, mm-hmm. uh, and in order to do that, we should open our mind. Mm-hmm. 
So oh, the the in, if you read the laws of justice, mm -hmm. uh, you can get you know uh, more fundamental knowledge on Islam, mm -hmm. and then and then maybe maybe you can change the mm -hmm. your image on Islam, mm -hmm. okay. and and oh, and also you can realize what is the problem. I see. Okay. So so then uh, the we we should think about what is right and what is wrong mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so which is which is the of justice i see okay so the definition there of justice is correct me if i'm wrong what i'm getting here is the definition of justice an awareness of what is right and what is wrong is okay this correct? So, so just yes but simply from the god's will no, from, justice is god justice okay oh okay okay so it's god's right. justice okay yeah all right okay so the book also refers to laws am i correct yes yeah what's what are like some of the laws that uh, are referred to that uh that are with regard to justice oh, excuse me uh, alex can you say it again yeah what are some of the laws that are in the book that uh that, that the book refers to refers to yeah so you you, you mean you mean yeah, okay. like like uh, the title says uh, law, right? I mean, there's uh, ah. So what are like some of the laws that you know uh. people might be interested in looking into? Uh -huh, uh -huh. Right. So uh, the the author Ryuho Okawa, mm -hmm. he he created his own brand, which is uh, law series. Mm. So he he published the, his first book, the Laws of the Sun. Mm -hmm. Laws of the Sun, and then he published the many Laws of Something. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, okay. So, uh, the Laws of Justice is the uh, the latest his book in his Laws brand. Mm. Okay. So Laws, Laws, Laws are not, you know, uh, the law uh, the, the created by, you know, government or, oh, okay. or, or Congress. Right. Right. Okay. Okay. So the Laws means uh, like a principles. You know, ah. principles. Okay. It's more spiritual meaning. Ah, I see. So it's more of like referring to principles than like actual yes. laws. You got to do this and stuff like that. Yes. Yes. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. I got that. Okay. I'm sure our mm -hmm. listeners will pick that up. <laughs> so, mm -hmm. Yuki, in your opinion, what's probably the most important principle among all the principles noted in this book? Mm -hmm. uh, the you know this book uh, the, the, the very interestingly this book uh did not give you know how to find the laws justice you know uh got got justice okay. but this book encouraged the readers uh to to seek the god's will ah. ab ab about their own issues and life problems mm. So maybe in order to seek the God's will, God's mm -hmm. justice, mm -hmm. we need maybe practice, spiritual practice, okay. such as uh, such as meditation mm -hmm. or prayer. Mm -hmm. okay. So oh, this is this is not easy, but yeah. <laughs> God, God always give us the opportunity to think about the answer from God. Mm -hmm. But God, God not give us the easy answer. Okay. So, so this book is encouraging people. Ah, so it's not like this book says, okay, this law number one, this law number two, this law number three. It's more like okay. this is how you can find the laws of uh, of yes. justice. That's right. So ah. uh, uh, the the in other in uh, the, in other books uh, written by Liu Hokawa, uh, he talked about the example of the U.S. president. Abraham Lincoln. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So when uh, Abraham Lincoln, uh, the every night, so meditated and prayed for God mm -hmm. to seek the the God's answer mm -hmm. about the big problems in U.S. those days. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So uh, so that is the attitude of the people who are seeking God's will. I see. Okay. So okay, cool. So uh, this is sort of like a sort of like a how-to book, how to enable people to find uh, 
God's will, universal justice. Mm, mm, yeah. So if you if you expect the how to book, yeah, yeah, you know about this, maybe you 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 are not satisfied. Oh, okay. All right. Mm. Okay. I got that because you know I I come from from where I from where my standpoint was. You know, if you see something like uh, loss and stuff like that, I think okay, this is like a how to mm -hmm. book. But okay, thank mm -hmm. you for that. Mm -hmm. uh, thank you for that clarification. <laughs> mm -hmm. So oh, that's why this book is not just know how book. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. How to book? Right. Okay. Right. Uh, but also other issue of, for example, the well, Russian president Putin mm -hmm. yes attained the the Crimea. Uh, I mean, uh, I, I, I'm not sure how to pronounce it. Okay. The, uh, and then and Russian president Putin's uh, behavior become always the problem or or. The, the big the, the, the argument right. among international community. So the the nobody knows who is right or, or Putin is right or wrong. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So or maybe uh, that I don't think there is a, a absolute right absolute right right rightness. Okay. But we we always have to seek the the better answers. So, oh, in order to attain the the God's will. Mm. So, beginning of, uh, the the first qu first chapter of this book, Laws of Justice, uh, Liu Hong are talking about the new one of the new U.S. Hollywood Hollywood movie, which mm. is called uh, uh, the title is God's God's Not Death, Not God's Not Dead. Oh, okay. okay. You, you, you know this film. Yeah, I've heard God's of it. Not, yes, yes. Uh, yeah, God's not there. God's not there. <coughs> yes. So, uh, the nowadays, uh, the, the many, many people, ex especially intelligent, academic people, uh, do not believe God is still alive. Mm -hmm. But uh, the one young student of the uh, the university, they insisted God is still alive. Right. Right. So uh, this this kind of uh, belief, strong belief. Uh, seeking God's will uh, can lead people to the better answer, mm. the more accurate answer. Okay, all right, cool. I got that. So Yuki, if I may ask, yeah. in your opinion, what is it about us human beings that we seem to consistently misconstrue what justice is all about, despite having the best intentions in mind? Hmm. Uh, the uh, since I joined Happy Science mm. and and began the spiritual practice mm. the 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 day day to day basis. Right. So I I realize the human mind uh, is 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 not perfect. <laughs> and, okay. Okay. And, yes. And, of course. And, and and human mind human mind always is the full of the negative thoughts. Mm. So it's not so pure. Mm. At the same time, I realize uh, we have the tremendous potential mm -hmm. to develop our mind, mm -hmm. and uh, uh, we have uh, a hidden power mm. within within the mind. Mm. So uh, the the that's why the spiritual uh, spiritual practice or just meditation every day. Mm -hmm. can change our mind and, and, and life. Mm -hmm. So uh, although the dispute, the laws of justice, is, is dealing with uh, the international politics, right, right. the author of this book the encourage the reader mm -hmm. to do some spiritual practice. Mm -hmm. So that's why this book is not just for the political leader. Okay, okay. So for for everyone. I see. So, so if you if you read this book, so you 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 you'd feel so I wanna be more spiritual. Right, right, right. Okay. Okay. So it's kind of like uh finding I don't know, finding what what's coming across to me is that it's like finding international peace by starting with oneself. Is this uh do I get that correct? Alex that's Absolutely right. Ah, okay. The, the world of peace should come from peace within. 
Ah, okay, cool. All right. Yay, I got something right today. <laughs> All right, cool. So, Yuki, I understand that you're a uh, political political observer. You're involved with politics, is that correct? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes, yes. Okay, because, I mean, uh, uh, speaking like, I mean, I'm sure you're aware of all the issues right now. They center usually around Asia, uh, which mm -hmm. Japan is a part of, and mm -hmm. also the United States, which is, let's face it, the world's biggest economy. Mm -hmm. And um, there is something going on in the U.S. right now where uh, they're picking their, their next leader. Mm hmm in your opinion, uh, who would be the better uh, candidate to become U.S. president where Asia and Japan are concerned? And in your opinion, why? Okay, okay. So, uh, since Mr. Obama, President Obama, uh, became U.S. president, mm -hmm. so people in Asia have, have been suffering from many political conflicts, mm -hmm. such as uh, China's invasion, uh, in South China Sea and yes. East China Sea. Yes. Uh, so and then we we realize that the the U.S. president is not just for U.S. but for for the world. Mm -hmm. So we need we need the a global leader, mm -hmm. which should be U.S. president. Mm -hmm. So if I if I see two candidates mm -hmm. from Japanese perspective, okay, I I think. The, the Mr. Trump is a very honest man. Mm -hmm. so I, I know there are many opinions. Okay, okay. And, 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 and also, oh, uh, sorry to say, but I don't trust the Mrs. Clinton. Oh, okay. Uh, because I feel she is hiding something. Mm. So, so that, so, and, and also, the Mrs. Clinton used to be uh, the Secretary of State. Mm -hmm. Yes. And, and when, when she was a secretary, uh, you know, North Korea, North Korea ha they developed the nuclear weapon project. Mm -hmm. And now, uh, North Korea almost completed the nuclear weapon, and mm -hmm. they can sell they can sell their own nuclear weapon to the Iran or other Middle East countries, mm -hmm. which okay. became the big threat to Japan and South Korea and Asia. Mm -hmm. So uh, that's why if the Mrs. Clinton becomes the U.S. president, mm -hmm. we are afraid mm -hmm. that the, the, the U.S. government will keep the current policies mm -hmm. in Asia. Mm -hmm. So we need big change. Okay. We need to change. Okay. So, so that's why uh, we expect uh, the Mr. Trump. I see, because you feel that Mr. Trump will deliver that change that Asia so desperately needs. Mm -hmm. And and Alex, the another point is uh, uh, again the Putin. Mm -hmm. Yes. The Putin. The, the the people in the world realize the Russian president Putin is a strong leader, mm -hmm. and. And the Mr. Obama, Mr. Obama didn't work with Putin very well. Mm -hmm. So we expect the new U.S. president to make a new relationship with Putin right. and solve the Middle East issues together. Mm, okay. I, I, I think, I think uh, uh, a new U.S. president must talk with Putin right. to, make sh to make sure that the, uh, the oil problem doesn't cause the new Great War. Uh-huh, yes. So especially, especially Japan uh -huh. is now going to make a Russia, Japan, Russia peace treaty. Yes. But the, in the history, the U.S. government always disagreed. Mm -hmm. You know, the the good relationship between U.S. and uh, Russia and Japan. Right, right. But if Japan and U.S. president, uh, uh, the, the, you know, or uh, we expect the U.S. and Russia can be friends. Right. So, and then Russia, U.S., and Japan can create a new relationship, mm. you know, international alliance. Yeah. So, which can be separate uh, China mm. and Russia. Mm. Okay. So, that, that's what we want. I see. Okay. And besides, if I, under, if I understand history correctly, Japan mm -hmm. has not signed a peace treaty with... Russia since World War Two, is that correct? 
Mm-hmm. Yeah. So uh, Jap- Japan and Russia's relationship is was very difficult. Yes. So, but now the the Japanese government is trying to find a way to have a peace treaty. Mm-hmm. And the Putin, Putin is is very personally. He is very pro Japanese. Mm-hmm. He is pro Japanese. He he played the Japanese the judo. Yes. Yes. I know. I know. Yeah. yeah. He's a black belt yeah. in that. I think. Right. That that's why now it's a it's a great opportunity for Japan mm. to to make a, a peace treaty. Okay. And right. we need the Russia, uh, because because you know because the the we can defend ourselves from. So, uh, Japan and Russia now are defining the new relationship, and and the, our goal is to have the p- new peace treaty. Mm. And which is very important for Japan because uh, we we have the big problem with the China, so right. that's why we need the peace treaty with Russia. Mm. Okay. All right. Cool. Okay. So Yuki, uh, go, getting on a little bit, a little bit personal. Let's say you came across someone, okay, who feels that he or she has been wronged, and she, he or she wants wants justice to be done for whatever wrong that was committed to that person. Now, this person has is human, okay, he has a particular view of justice that may not correspond to universal justice, and you had only enough time to tell that person one thing about universal justice or finding universal justice. What would be that one thing you would tell that person, and why would you tell them that? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, I would say, I would say, Again, God is still alive. Okay. And and that God loves you. Mm-hmm. So oh, so so please believe God is still alive. Mm. So the, the the reason why I'm I'm telling that telling this is the always we forget the existence of God, mm. and we focus on the daily life. Mm-hmm. But if we are uh, the if we receive the reminder mm-hmm. from from heaven, mm-hmm. so the, the we can be spiritual. Mm. Okay, well that's interesting words like there. Mm-hmm. Okay, so Yuki, I wish we could talk some more, but uh, we're coming to the end of this interview. So um, in closing, then our guest is author is our guest is Yuki Oikawa, who's speaking for author Master Ryuho Okawa. Uh, the book is The Laws of Justice, How We Can Solve World Conflicts and Bring Peace. And you can find the book on okawabooks.com. That's O-K-A-W-A books.com, one word. And also an online store such as Amazon. So, Yuki, you know, thank you very much for your time. Thank you very much for being an author story. Uh, great insights right there. It was great to have you with us as our guest. You know, Otsukagasama uh, deshita. Alex, thank you very much. <laughs> cool. You're <laughs> welcome. And of course, for those of you listening, if you want to get Master Okawa's book, The Laws of Justice, you can get it right now by going to the Amazon link in the description below the video. And if you'd like to follow our author interviews on YouTube, it's easy. Just click on subscribe. So, so long for now, guys. I'll be back next time on Author Story with another inspiring author.